really hard to tell on the camera, but this is the uh, conditions we're dealing with right now. Oh my god. Ugh. Well, yeah, the trailer got swinging a little bit there. Good morning, everybody. Thank you for tuning in into today's video. Uh, today we're responding to a rollover. Yay, got some action. So, uh, we're going to be headed to Palm Springs, to the city of Palm Springs. The Palm Springs Police Department actually called us out to uh, do this. <laughs> what? What? What did you say? What? What did you say? Okay, that's what I thought. Palm Springs uh, Police Department actually called us out for this one. Uh, they don't have any vendors on their rotation list that can do heavy duty uh, rollovers. What's up? No, I'm good. Um, so they're calling us out directly to take care of this. We got a rollover, empty tractor trailer. It's pretty windy right now. And where this truck rolled over, it's usually pretty windy there as well. So I imagine it's a wind related rollover. Um, so that's really all the information we have at the moment. I got one picture. Um, doesn't look like that big of a deal. It's obviously empty, which helps a lot. Uh, so Taylor and I, I got the uh, rotator obviously, and then Taylor's got truck 24 uh, fueled up, ready to go. We're gonna go ahead and head out and see what we can get into. So let's go ahead and uh, head over and see what's going on. Probably hard to tell on the camera, but this is the uh, conditions we're dealing with right now. I think this is dirt, I think this is water. Very, uh, well, there's a combination of water and dirt, so it's pretty nasty out. They're reporting like 35, 40 mile an hour winds at the moment, 56 degrees. So we're gonna get on scene here. We're just about to our freeway exit, see what we're dealing with here. I don't know, there goes the rain. Nice. We're gonna see what, what's involved here. It might not be something we're gonna upright in this kind of weather, because it obviously rolled over because of it, so we'll see.
Come on, son. Slow the wind down. Let's just go right here, Taylor. Oh, my God. You want little slack or water slack? Uh, good amount of time. I have an extra one of these face coverings. You want it? You want one? Yeah, I have one. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. I would, uh, you want one of the big wood straps to go underneath the trailer here? Well, yeah, I actually brought one out of Darrell's truck. I brought an extra long one because uh, considering it would be set up in the middle, we're going to have to span a lot more distance than 12 feet. So that'll be what we'll do. All right, I'm going to take it up, see what happens. Big old sail. We got clearance there? Yeah, it looks like it. All right, let's work with that. Straight, at least where we're working, and then we can deal with the rest later. Okay. Okay, this is kind of roughly where I want to be, so you just start going up toward the uh, center of the trailer, kind of roughly where the boom is going to be on my truck. Okay, hold that. Um, hang on, let me just tuck this so it doesn't go flying. I'm going to grab a shackle and I'm going to lock it in. Um, I'm going to hook this over to you. Throw that on your end. I gave you credit. I answered my phone this morning. Second time? I was getting worried. You only called me once. You called me twice. Did you? Yeah. Well, it was 5.30. I was thought it was my alarms going off. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's right. You have like 30 alarms. I have four, okay. So for the viewers out there, we just got a second rollover, so Dad and uh, Jonathan are responding to that, and we'll see what that's all entailing, but sounds like the day is going to be a crazy one. All right, pull, boy, pull. You want me to pull my side? Yeah, pull it through. I'm hooked. So you can't go. Hang on. Give me a little bit of slack. Straighten okay. it up oh. a little. Okay, go ahead. Yep, there you go. Uh, grab some mud flap here. Okay. When hold you on, hold on, hold on. All right. Just let me know when you can give me a little slack. Okay. Go for it. Okay. Okay. Go ahead and pull what you need. Well, I, I'm good here. I'll just good. make it straight underneath the trailer. Okay. Now, let me. Uh, See what you're dealing with here. Okay. Um, the only thing I don't want to do is end up in that shit. Yeah. Do you have strap protectors on your truck? I think I do. I forget where I go. Yes. You do? Okay. Let me, I think I do right here. Let me check. Mine. Uh, I got mine right here. Okay. Let's put this on that. And... Considering that it's uh, already compromised on that nose, I'm not too worried about putting angle iron. But normally you would want to. Yeah. But I have a feeling, based on where the strap's at right now, it's going to end up in that pocket anyway, which is going to suck. But... I want to try to keep it right there, though. So if it gets into there, it's just going to pull a hole through the roof. It's a uh, Velcro, Taylor. Oh, I think so. Yeah, I want to see how far you get with it. Oh, bouncy, bouncy. Oh, <laughs> Go in as much as you can. Like, eh, that should be okay, I think. Yeah, let's work with that. All right, uh, are we straight under there? Hey, we look good. Huh? Yeah, we're good. Okay. When I come down, go for it, Daddy. 
All right, coming down. Ow, my finger. Hmm. Probably end up using that chain on the nose for the landing gear catch. Okay. And then we'll do a... Uh, Actually, you know what, Taylor? Let's uh, let's ditch that, and I'm gonna do rim sling to uh, shackle to strap. That way, we don't have any chain involved for the catch, so we don't have to tape it up. Okay. Like, well, not the small, small one, but like the medium shackle. It medium shackle? Yeah, the inch and a quarter. Okay. How many uh, wheel ropes do you have? Uh, I got one more. All right, I might need to borrow it. Okay. Do you have any? You have one? I have one. Okay, so we'll, if the rims permit, we'll do those on each rim. Okay. I'm going to climb up on the drive, see what the drive looks like. Okay, might as well rig this up then. Want to go through? Yeah, since we're doing a down pull, that's fine. going to have to chain the axle. <sighs> what are you doing with up on the steer? Steer, I could probably get away with one of these as well. Okay, let's see. Because uh, it's just a standard rim. The brake's set. Feel like it. To me, it looks like the brakes aren't set. That's what it looks like, right? But That's what I said. They're probably low on air, but it hasn't set yet. Do you want to grab me your other wheel swing while I'm up here and I'll tie up the driver's steer as well? Yeah, you have yours? Yeah, mine's already around the... Oh, yeah, yeah, side okay. Okay. Here you go, Papas. I think uh, we should maybe try... Unless we have like a glass breaker or something to get in that windshield. It's already cracked. But I think we should try to set the brakes. <coughs> Either that or try to drain the tank. See if they automatically set. I don't think the brake set, so I'm gonna climb up there and we're gonna have to climb into there. See if that's if that if they don't look set, but they have play to go in, right? Yeah. Okay. They're out. That's weird. They don't have any gap like they normally do, huh? No, they don't. Okay. Well, we know. It's good. All right. You good? Clear. Oh, I thought my foot was gonna get chopped off. trucks located for the yeah when i was positioned you had you were in place right yeah okay yeah that's fine i would uh i mean the closer the better so actually we should get you closer all right Give you, and we'll go low lines sounds good get the most down pull on it we also need to chain that rear drive axle yeah i'll get a chain on it here in a second plums and all that before we hey, uh, give those a flip a do there Taylor huh? give it a flip that's the only time that you go hook opposite is on the snatch blocks because when they when you when it comes up to play it's gonna end up bloating right there so if you do it the other way Let's uh, put a chain on that axle before you take tension. Yeah, I'm just getting some slack out of the way. Okay. We chaining the front axle too or not? No, that would be fine. Just wanna, so we don't pull the airbag. 
Gotcha. My small chains are right in there. Yeah, I got one. top of the trailer and feed white to the other side and I'll hook it in. It's just I'm pulling it sideways and it doesn't like it. Okay. That should be enough. Alright, um, stay up there for a second. I'm gonna, um, I'm gonna lock it in. Try to get it up over the edge there. Okay. Coming up over the edge there. Not yet. You want to cable in a little bit? I'm, I'm holding tight. Uh, I want to get it up there a good ways first. So I gotta be up at least. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, I have to cable out on that too, but yeah. Okay, you're good there. Hold on. Right, you want to straighten up that uh, shock before you lose it? you take some pressure up. Go ahead and pull on your drive. 
Airport Drive. Okay, that's good. Perfect. Try to keep that shackle out. So right now I'm booming up and in to just try to keep that shackle out of the out, out of the wall of the trailer. Okay, make sure. Um, let's hold it right there. Let's unhook uh, the drives. Hey, nice job. That was sweet. Okay, um, yeah, let's unhook that while it's up. Keep pressure on this. I'm gonna get going. I'm gonna tighten up on the white. Just keep some pressure on it. So it wants to go over again. Okay, I'm gonna let down on the catch. See if it'll settle. Want him to go back over? Oh, give me a second. I'm gonna need to let out the drive a little bit. Okay. 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 I think she's sitting pretty. I'm slack. Okay. I think uh, I think I can break down, but I think it'd be a good idea for me to keep the truck here, get you hooked up. I'm gonna give you a wind lock. lock, and then we'll get you moving. All right. Nice job. That was smooth. Textbook. Yes, I like it. I need to strap the hood down. Broke the hood latches. Minute. Yeah. People are so stupid. Like seriously, what do you think you're gonna go? You see police lights, big trucks down at the end of the road. Big road close sign. <laughs> yeah. Well, at least it was 5:30 in the morning, not one in the morning. Exactly. All right, I'm gonna let off here. See how it looks. Oh yeah, I think she's sitting. That will do, donkey. That will do. <laughs> While you break down, I'll get the front of the truck on. Okay. How low can I go on the boom up there before I hit the top of the trailer? Keep going. 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 Yeah, that's good right there. If you don't want me to go anywhere, how am I going to hook up? Not you. Vertex. You can get the, the step up forks from those. You can get them under there. And it gives you a little bit of extra clearance. You dive under it. That's what I do. Alright, let's test your theory. Looks like the freaking hinge is pulling out of this door, the chain box door, from like all the times that swung open because of the wind. taught me something today. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. It seems like the axle sits higher on than those ones with that, uh, like, skid plate right by the radiator. Yeah. That's how I d differentiate them. That's why I have an editor. Just going to have to put, like, beep, 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 for our conversations. Right. Well, I forget the, the, the headsets are put together on the Yeah. Now, is it you that edits them, or is it someone else? My cousin. I used to edit them, like when I first started.
Oh, bro. I'm gonna throw your light bear on. Did we never put that light that Jonathan got for you? No, I haven't yet. I have it in my truck, though. Under a hundred in both tanks. Get some tape. I do not know. I'm out. Zip ties, anything? I got zip ties, why? Well, the airline is very loose, and so it keeps wanting to pop out. Yeah, the glad hand, I should say. Yeah, let me get you a zip tie. That's an interesting setup. Huh? I'll show you when you get back here. Interesting setup. Look at this. We got like what the valves on there. Yeah. Okay. <sighs> Alright, you're ready to go otherwise? I just need to put this type of server up real quick. Okay. Otherwise, my hood strap, you put the light bar back there for me. Okay. Sure. I got safety chains already ran. I'm good to go. Okay. I just need to get this squared away real quick. Secured. What are you doing? That's my constant there. What's up? <laughs> Don't forget, I was like born in this truck. Yeah. I was, I was born again. That's where I learned. Yeah, you can buy the ones that are tinted. Yeah, nah, I like the clear because most of the time that shit's at night anyway. Well, that's why I bought them clear, just because of that. You want an energy drink? It's not open. No. <laughs> Alright, I think you're good, yeah. Alright guys, well that's a wrap on that rollover. If you guys heard early in the video, we do have another rollover that we're working right now that my dad and some of the other guys are on. So I'm en route to that now. Uh, I'm not sure if this is gonna be all one video or not. Probably not. So, uh, but yeah, it's gonna be a busy day. So we'll see what's what this next one entails. I know it's loaded, so a little bit trickier. But yeah, we're in tow and we're out of here. Thanks for watching, guys. As always, like, comment, subscribe. Let me know in the comments what you thought about the video. See you on the next one. Thanks for watching.